the heartbeat of a city. It's something you can see and hear. And sometimes, if you really listen, let's get down to some real music. <laughs> you can hear its soul. Make love in the green grass. I stay it's the soul of the city, it's the soul of America. And once you feel that emotion, man, I, I don't care what's going on, man. I don't care who you are, or whatever, man. It crosses the line to, of everything. From his corner stage on Del Mar Loop, street musician Ray Douglas has seen a city and a nation divided. You can't disagree with anyone because it's you, you, you just like you, they start disrespecting you and, you know, you can't even get to the subject because it's a fight. And I'm hoping that you come back to me. Play it one time. Thane Bradford has also seen his share of problems. It's very obvious when you wake up and hear the news <laughs> every morning, there's a lot of negativity and there is a lot of uh, division. But recently, street performers like Lee Maxwell have noticed that the issues that separate us disappear when they are performing. I love to play music because it makes people happy. Every time they walk past, they smile and they listen to what I'm doing. They say through music, maybe we have a chance at erasing the lines that have divided a nation. So yes, there is hope. With a little patience and a little time, these things might will turn around. I think there's definitely hope for us. And for all of us racing from here to there, if we just take the time to listen for the soul. And I think music is really a great way to try and reach out with other people, no matter what you believe in. The music makers on Del Mar say we might have a chance at a wonderful world. You know, I know Louis Armstrong, but I want to kind of make people happy, so maybe stop fighting for one minute. On the Del Mar Loop. See, music is the soul of America. Wade Smith, Fox 2 News.